Look at the difference between this side and this side. Well, I have to go in 20 minutes and I've got to look presentable. What am I gonna do? I haven't even had a chance to wash my face this morning. I'm gonna use these. I don't normally use wipes, but for something like this, it comes in handy. Darn cowlicks. Let's put these back. Boop. And boop. Maybe that will tame them a little bit. A little bit of Polish Choice B5 Super Plus Eye Serum. Serum? It's a cream. And a little bit up here. Not on my eyelids though. Right here especially. I'm gonna put a bit of this on. This is Magic Serum. It has niacinamide, hyaluronic acid. Good stuff, good stuff. Magic Cream. I know these are high end but my skin really likes this cream. I'm sure there's good stuff out there that doesn't cost as much, but but my skin likes it. Okay, good. Some on my hands. <laughs> How's my time? Okay, that's taken me three minutes. A little bit of sunscreen. This is the Centella sunscreen that I used the other day, and I really like it. I do wanna let that set in a little bit before I go into my makeup. So look at this hair. Uh, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna use my shark to boost up my hair and water. Water is my best friend when it comes to my cowlicks. Okay, also my crown right here. That's where I always get that split and it looks like I've got a bald spot. I hate it when that happens. be good enough. Anyone with calyx, you know. There we go. Ah, not bad. Oh, <laughs> While I'm doing my makeup, I'm gonna push that down and see if I can get it to behave. What am I gonna put? Oh, I have new foundation to try. I'm excited about this one. This is by the brand Bosma, and they were nice enough to send me some. I hope I picked the right colors. This is not the time to be checking this out, but I'm so curious. Oh, this is really pretty. That's up my alley completely. Okay, this is number 034. That actually looks pretty good. Okay, that's a definite maybe. You can see it a little bit though. This one is 025, so I'm really sure that's not gonna be, oh. Wait, am I saying that right? Three, four, and two, five. Oh, that one isn't bad either. Okay, I actually think that one looks better than this one. Interesting. I would have thought that two, five would be lighter, but it's just a different tone maybe. And then this one is zero, two, nine. Yeah. That's actually the best one so far. Just wanna put it up here too. Yeah, okay, <laughs> it just keeps getting better. Funny, they all seem suitable. This one is 030. I think I'm gonna do the 029. What does this say? Is it, it must be a fairly sheer foundation. Lightweight formula, natural finish. Okay, let's just go for it. I'll do one side first and we'll see. And I'm slathering it on because I wanna go fast. Got BK Beauty 101. This is a travel size, so this isn't a 101. Oh yeah, it's just a travel size 101. Wow, that looks really pretty. And easy. Look at that. Oh, I like that. I'm gonna put a little bit more on my sunspots here and just tap it in rather than swipe and wipe. Nice. A little bit more just right in there and pressing it in. That's where I'm really red. 
I wonder if I use a lighter one in here, what it will do. Let's just do this one. It's just a little bit lighter. And I'm gonna tap it in with my finger. Oh, it's a really nice finish, guys. Now, up close. Be interesting to see how this wears, but my first impressions, it's really pretty. Let's go on this side. Oh, I'm just like willy nilly. Honestly, it feels light enough that if you had to, or you prefer to, you could use your fingers. I'm not sure what it would be like with a sponge. I should use it with a sponge. Maybe in my next video I will. But that is super pretty. What a great little thing to put in your purse too. First of all, it's pretty. You can touch up so easily with a stick. I love sticks. little bit of that one uh, oop. Oh. a little bit there under that eye to brighten it up thank you Basma I was so excited to try this and I'm glad I did where's my lid okay oh my god I got four minutes the next most important thing for me is my brows because they make all the difference, especially for fair-haired girls. They're not gonna be perfect, but that's okay. Oh, they're really not perfect. I'd like them to be a little bit better. It's fine, it's fine. They also got new gloss. You see us all using the Stands Out sponge and they have gloss and they were so nice to send that to me too. So I'm gonna try this. Oh, that's pretty. There, perfect. Adds a bit of color, nice and natural. It smells so good. Oh, I really like that. Nice. Is that gonna do anything? Let's try this. This is the Laura Mercier Guava Blush. Since I don't have a lot of color, this might be really nice. Will it show up? I almost forgot powder in right here. Let me just pinch this. A little bit of powder here. Maybe just a little, little bit of bronzer here just to make my forehead not glow. Maybe just a bit on the outer. Oh, I always go too heavy. Like that, like that. Good, mascara. You know what, I just won't curl my lashes. I have been liking this lately. This is Benefit Fan, Fan Fest. I'm not used to not curling my lashes, but it is what it is. Oh, oh, come on. <sighs> yeah, I made a mess, that's okay fix it in the car. Good enough. How do these look? Oh, my hair just got stuck in my mascara. Good enough. Is it good enough? A little bit more blush. Okay, I'm gonna check back in after my errands and show you how this looks after I've worn it for a few hours and I'll be back. It's a couple hours after I applied the foundation and I wanted to do a check-in. I'm gonna get into the daylight here and see if you can see details. When I'm looking in the mirror and in my camera, I think my skin looks really good. So I haven't gone for a walk with the dogs yet or anything. We'll see how it looks after that. But yeah, I think my skin looks really good. I don't see any creasing in this area. No creasing in this area. My pores look really good. And I even used it under here and I don't see any creasing or movement either. So I'm really happy with this so far. I'll check in in a few hours. 
Okay, it's 9.37. I've had the Bosma foundation on all day. I really feel that this has lasted a long time. My skin looks good. I don't really feel like I have to touch up much. I went for a walk with the dogs. I did just put lip gloss on though. But anyway, I feel like this is really, really pretty. I can't believe how well this lasted. Let's check around my nose. Typically wears off around here because I wear glasses and I blow my nose all the times. So if anything, it's rubbed off around here. Yeah, my skin looks really good. So if I were going out and I just wanted to touch up a little bit, say right there, and I didn't have a brush, but I had to go out for dinner. How easy would this be? And how well does it build? Nice. Touch a little bit right there. Even under my eyes, I feel like they don't look bad. Let's see if I boost up there too. There, touch up is easy. Thank you, Buzzma. They didn't ask me to post, by the way. They just wanted to know if I wanted to try it. And I'm really impressed. So thank you again. And I hope this helps. Let me know if you guys have tried this before. And I'll see you later. Bye.